shock you all here because understandably we're giving Liverpool a lot of praise for how young their team was, as we've just, as we've just showed. However, Chelsea actually had a younger start 11 than Liverpool yesterday. And of the two teams on the pitch at the end, again, Chelsea's was younger. All right, so you can kind of see there that the average age at the start was, was you know, pretty much two years younger for Chelsea and about what year and a half younger at the end of the match. So is that narrative unfair on Chelsea, giving Liverpool the praise for having that young team on the pitch, but actually Chelsea's was younger? I think it was the impact of the substitutes and it was the fact that these unknown players were being introduced uh, on the biggest stage, particularly when you look at some of the appearances that they'd made. Kwanzaa, just eight appearances in the Premier League. Clark, just four. McConnell, three. Dan's one. That's just 16 Premier League appearances combined for those young players, whereas the young Chelsea team obviously have played in the top flight a lot more. But, uh, but uh, when you look at the graphic there, actually quite amazing to think that that Chelsea team that finished this, the game was younger than the Liverpool team. But again, it's about the narrative that the media creates, the fact that we're talking about these young Liverpool players, and it just almost skews what you're thinking.